I've been invited here by the British Embassy and the British Council uh, to help promote my new book, The Empathy Problem, uh, which is being featured at the EU Literature Night. This is my most recent book, yes. It was published um, in the UK a couple of years ago and came out in Czech translation in October last year. Um, so it's still quite new in, in Czech. It's my latest book and it's about a, um, a financial manager who has a brain tumour. And he discovers at the beginning of the book that he has a brain tumour and he has only a few months left to live. And it's about how the, um, the, the tumour changes his personality and changes his life. My, my background is my dad's a scientist, my dad's a, a biologist, and uh, my mum's a linguist. She taught uh, French and German and English for a little bit as well. So I've sort of always had this, these two interests that I've got quite a strong um, interest in science that definitely came from my dad, and he um, was always... He, he's, there's certain ways in which he's a bit of an Alex Woods character in himself. He's very, very obsessively interested in, in what he does, which I, I think is a really great quality. And then from my mum, I got my sort of love of language and English and reading in particular as well. Um, my my mum's always been a huge reader and she really sort of got us, all of me and my siblings, interested in reading at a very young age. So. Um, at school and right through sort of my education, I was really interested in writing and reading and science, and that all came together in this first book. Um, I think I found out at quite a young age that, I, I mean, I, I was okay at science and maths and things like that at school, but I, I was much more at home um, writing. I, I wrote from a very young age and always sort of wanted to, to be a writer. It's sort of my... Um, my guilty ambition for a while because I didn't think anything was going to come of it. Um, so, yeah, it's interesting because I, I guess it was my parents, but those are the influences that went into the first book in particular, but my subsequent books as well. But I think I've got a sort of amateurish interest in science in that I find the ideas fascinating more than actually um, the technical side of, of science. And um, yeah, the, the love of writing has just, it's always been there from a, a very, very young age. Yeah, it was really great, yeah. I, I visited Argo for the first time um, when The Empathy Problem was published, which was back in October. And yeah, they're a fantastic little publisher. I was surprised at how little they are physically. They've got a tiny little um, office in, in Prague and they like publish Dan Brown and, and um, Game of Thrones, George R. R. Martin and stuff. So they've got some huge, huge names on their list. And they've got this sort of ramshackle um, little building that's got papers everywhere. And um, it's quite beautiful. It's how I'd imagine that all publishing houses used to be. And just a really... Um, lovely, passionate, small team who just, um, you know, love books. I think that's the great thing about publishing, wherever you go in the UK, I've never met a publisher who isn't just obsessed with books and that's why everyone does it really. So, you know, it's nice being part of that uh, community and it's been the same in the Czech Republic. Everyone's just so um, enthusiastic and lovely to work with.